Okay, so this is a model of an animal cell that we're drawing, and we're going, it's, it's in the illustration, it's cut in half so we can see the parts of it. So you got that shape. We started with this kind of, uh, kind of avocado shape. Underneath, under, we're going to make the underside just to the nice curve that goes from one side to the other. Okay, so we've got the body of the cell. Now we're going to go ahead and draw the nucleus, which is that big ball uh, pit looking thing. So I'm just drawing a, a curve that goes over, go, going o cutting over through this, this, the cell wall, or cell membrane. And we're making a bone. And then we can make a, another curve where it goes into the cell. So this is the center of, center of the of the cell called the nucleus. Simplify them and just make these kind of long oval shapes. Go ahead and try to fill those in a little. I want you guys to understand that they are actual things, uh, objects within the cell. They have a function. The the area over here, if you can look at this, kind of like pink, ribbony sort of things, Angel. Pick these pink, ribbony little things. Those are the, what are they called? Noodles. <laughs> you said noodles. <laughs> noodles. <laughs> yeah, it's the, it's the chicken noodles. Golgi body. The Golgi body, which is receive, receive materials from the endoplasmic reticulum and send them to other parts. So like um, these... Mitochondria. We'll just make those into ovals. Lysosomes. All these little dots, these little black dots in the diagram. Ribosomes. Cell membrane.